Well, happening tomorrow, another beloved local holiday tradition, the NOR Christmas Parade. And here to tell us more about what to expect is Jasmine Lavasso with the North of the River Recreation and Parks Department. Thank you so much for stopping by again. Thank you. So tomorrow's the big day. You're a very busy woman. What do you have coming together for the big day tomorrow, and what do people need to know? So this is our Grinchmas Parade. So this is all Grinch-themed entries this year. And I think that what people need to know is that the roads will be closed leading up to the parade. So definitely arrive early get a good spot, bring a chair, a blanket, get comfortable so that you can get your best viewing location. Maybe bring some hot cocoa, whatever's going to keep you warm while you're out there. Uh, so yeah, just make sure to arrive early with your family. Perfect. And then also when you're driving, watching out for all those pedestrians walking Absolutely. and getting to their spots. So you've brought the blanket, you've brought the hot cocoa. What are you going to see as the parade is going by? So we have a whole range of entries. We have almost 50 entries in our parade this year. I really personally love the bands, but what's really exciting is at the end of our parade, we actually have the NOR Holiday Band, which is a combination of a high school and local junior high bands in the Oildale area. So that's a wonderful finale to the parade. You'll see Santa and Mrs. Claus, and then a whole bunch of local businesses and organizations. And I just love the small town feel of this parade because you don't allow anything motorized. Nope, we do not. Everything is manually driven. Either it's animals or bikes or pushed by hand. So there's only manually uh, entered floats and and. and Trees. So yes, nothing is motorized and that makes it really, really special. It does indeed. And then, of course, whenever we have a performance, we say, don't take pictures, don't take video because it might disrupt people on stage. But this is so different. This is out in the community. Are you going to be live streaming or doing anything in case people can't go in person? So the really exciting thing is that this year it is the first time we are ever live streaming it. So if you cannot show up or maybe you have to leave early, whatever your reasons are, you can actually see the whole parade on our Facebook at NOR Fun, which is our handle. We will be having our camera right at the judges table so you'll hear our MCs, you'll see the performances at the judged entries. So definitely check it out online as well. So fun. And then for people who are there with the Grinch Miss Parade and they're snapping their photos, what's the best way to get them to you to then go on and share them with the rest of the community? Oh, definitely send it through Facebook to us. We will absolutely share our community photos. We want you to have fun. This is a wonderful free community event. It is. Thank you for all your hard work to make this happen. We're excited for tomorrow. Absolutely. And again, happening at 10 a.m. tomorrow in Oildale. We'll be right back.